Hello, Namaste, Salam Alaikum, Sastrikal. Welcome back to another session with your washef at Vareva.com. Today we are going to learn the South Indian buttermilk, what we call Majjiga and the North Indian kind of buttermilk. There is a slight difference between both of them, we are going to learn it today. To make the South Indian kind of uh, buttermilk, we need to add green chilli. So finely chop um, green chilli. Make sure this is very fine because if you have thicker than this, you will not be able to drink this uh, buttermilk. And a lot of people what they do is they just crush the green chilli because if they don't want to get it in the mouth, just crush it and add to the buttermilk so that the good flavor comes but you will not get a piece of chilli in the mouth. Same thing goes with ginger. You can just crush the ginger and add to it. And uh, chop the curry leaves also very fine. Coriander also. Add little bit of cumin onto your hot tawa. Just uh, dry roast it till you get a nice flavor. Then you will be able to powder it fine. Put this jeera on table and then using a rolling pin make a powder. Whenever you make chas or the South Indian buttermilk, the jeera powder becomes very important. Always make it fresh. That's when your buttermilk will have a very nice flavor. Take a curd in a bowl and whisk it up. You can make this buttermilk in a food processor or blender. Add twice the quantity. If you take one cup of uh, thick yogurt, take uh, two cups of water. But if your curd is little bit thin, then add one cup of curd to one cup of water. Add salt to this. Now the most important thing is salt. Salt should not be too much, it should not be less. It should be perfect. Taste it couple of times till you get it right. To this, add your uh, green chilli, crushed or chopped, crushed ginger, coriander and curry leaves. This is perfect. Very little jeera powder. Now this uh, kind of South Indian kind of buttermilk is uh, more stronger in sense because green chilli and ginger. Lot of concentrated flavors in this and uh, I'm going to have some of this buttermilk. Make sure you don't get the big piece green chilli. What we do in the restaurants is in the morning we make a big container of uh, buttermilk. We add ginger, green chilies into it and uh, when the order comes we mix it and then we give it. Ah. Add salt to this. To make a North Indian kind of chas, for one glass of chas, you can add a pinch of jeera and a pinch of chaat masala and then a good glass of buttermilk. Wow, this is my buttermilk. Top it off with little more jeera powder. This is a typical North Indian kind of buttermilk we serve in the restaurants, but you can always make your own variations. Ah. This buttermilk is perfect. You can have it usually on a sunny day or even with the meals you can have this salted buttermilk. Whenever you go to the restaurant, if you ask for plain lassi or salt lassi, this is the buttermilk that they get for you. Dear friends, I hope you have enjoyed to learn how to make this buttermilk, the South Indian style and the North Indian style. Hope you have enjoyed today's session. But remember, Vareva is all about inspiring others to cook. So please post your recipes and cooking tips at Vareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you.